Pisces all sign singles. Let's see. Without courage, we cannot practice any other virtue with consistency. We can be kind, true, merciful, generous, generous, or honest. Maya Angelou. Okay, so I feel like uh, poetry in motion was like, uh, I think that was Leo. So you might feel confident again. It's like you've gained your footing in feeling more confident. Okay, so there could have been some energy that felt like... Um, didn't feel very grounding to you I want to say okay but now I feel like uh, you're moving in a more confident direction I like that and you're trying new things and that's what I like there's a progression here Capricorn was wanting to go in a new direction and here I feel like you you are all right so look how you shine darling okay we are the perfect blend. And there's someone in the, you feel like is your perfect blend, but you've had to um, go in other directions. No one is you and that's your power. Okay. Yeah. They hold a sweet spot in your heart. Okay. So you're doing this, creating your own new reality. You do what queens do and you will rule. Okay. Okay. Okay, so you might be feeling a little wild on the wild side with this Taurus moon. That came up in the shorts. Okay. Now, you do have the sun transit, so you might feel more positive. Um, that's what I'm picking up. Okay, so I fall for you over and over again. Okay, so I feel like that's you or them, and you spice up my life. Okay. Okay. It's like you have some sort of magic that no one else has, and they know it. Okay. Let's get uh, tarot. Woo, and the split. We'll take that. Okay, so luck is on your side, Pisces, and this is feeling... Yeah, after tempering those emotions, I feel like, oh, this is looking like Scorpio energy. Okay, so you might go see Sagittarius and Scorpio for you. Okay, there might be some points there. But look, that's the potential that's here. Now, someone that you saw as a player might uh, balance out their energy and come towards you. Okay, so that potential is here. Okay. Okay. All right, and you saw them as going all over the place. Okay, it's like, uh, all right, so that's for someone. Now, there's another Pisces here, and it's like uh, spinning the wheel of fortune and coming up with more l cups of uh, productivity and abundance, and, and that's uh, building on family. Okay, building on family. So there's two kids here. Okay, so that might be something. All right, so. Yeah, this is the year of the water rabbit, right? So people might be getting, uh, dancing with the moon there and coming <laughs> up with some offspring. Okay. All right, so let's get some angels. Oh, wait, let's see who, for the singles with nobody, right? Okay. Let's see what signs might be coming towards you. Oh. Okay, Libra. I feel like that's about you balancing out your energy and you persevering through your dream work and thinking about cause and effect. It's like staying in your honor and integrity, right? Even if other people are doing stuff. Yeah, and that's how you transform... And opening up and communicating instead of holding it in. But for some of you, it's a water sign. Okay. Or a Libra that's been hiding their emotions for you. Okay. Could be Sagittarius. Okay. Venus. Okay. So this could be an Aries. The Venus transit is, is an Aries. So this could be an Aries who wants to travel with you. Okay, or this could be that person that travels a lot and you have love for them and you wish they would include you. 
Okay, and that was part of the thing that you had to heal within your own energy because they weren't, weren't including you. Now, for some of you, it's a Virgo with air. Yeah, and you feel like they're your soulmate. Okay, but they might be dealing with some stuff here. All right, let's see. They want to birth something with you. Yeah. It's like they've been uh, playing this waiting game. What is that? It, they, they're trying to reach for, I'm getting the Taurus. <laughs> Not Taurus, like Taurus, this astro. I'm getting like Taurus. Um, you know, the Taurus field, the Taurus field. That's what I'm getting. T-O-R-U-S. Okay. So for some of you, it might be an Aquarius. Okay. And they're trying to illuminate their own mind so that they could see in a better way. They could have been doing some shadow dancing there. Okay. So that could just be the moon. Could have been you too, moving out of that. But see, here's Aquarius energy. All right, but you're moving in a new direction, Pisces. Okay, yeah, it's like you trump some sort of uh, challenging energy. Okay, now for some of you, this is that um, you're not showing how you really felt towards a Cancer sign. All right. Yeah, and there's going to be some, maybe some revelations here. I want to see what that is. Woo! I feel like they're going to come for you. Okay. If not, that's you. It's like not being able to hold it back. Okay. It's like that song, I want to run to you. Woo Who sings that? I want to run to you. Oh, Whitney Houston. I want to run to you. Okay. And heal this thing. Or come together with you. Like the stars aligning. Woo! Okay, but what's going on is both people, uh, you're both clear about it. Communicate it. That's the message. Woo! Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah. Oh my gosh. This is being able to build with them. You saw them as shady and sneaky sometimes. Okay, but they saw that in you too, and that could have been the problem. And then here is... The Two of Cups and the Wish Fulfillment. Oh my gosh. Pisces. This is amazing. Let's get a prayer on it. <laughs> Living with a <the> prayer. <laughs> Hope and a prayer. Okay, let's get that. Okay, now for some of you, it was money issues that was causing uh, some problems here. Arguments about money. Your self-care involves removing the heavy burden of financial and emotional debts from your life. You already feel lighter and freer just by facing the topic and making a plan to clear present obligations and avoid future ones as well. Okay, so it's like if you have problems financing, uh, you can get help. There's all kinds of people who could teach you or take classes on it. Go on the internet. There's all kinds of things. And whatever abundance you see someone else having, you can have that and more. Okay? And this is like uh, moving into a better place about that. Okay. Woo! Gratitude list. Counting your blessings and feeling gratitude for what you already have helps you be centered and in your heart instead of fixated on worries in your mind. What... And who are you grateful for right now? Keep focusing upon gratitude and you'll discover the amazing generosity of this universe. 
Okay, so now the other thing I'm picking up with this money thing here is, is that um, if you take one step towards making change or whatever your financial situation is, that little step is going to help you feel more empowered to take be bigger steps and communicate better about uh, money. And I leave you with that.